Welcome to the Health It Up channel. In this video, we will understand the effects of electromagnetic radiations on human beings, particularly children. The prolonged and increased exposure of newborns and young children to EMR from smart gadgets may be the cause of autism, ADHD, and a few other issues in young children. Studies conducted all around the world provide sufficient evidence of the health risks associated with extended exposure to electromagnetic radiation, particularly for young children and infants. A new parent in today's world would be overwhelmed by the sheer volume of recommendations and guidance available online. What can you follow and how much content can you consume? But there is one universal rule that has stood the test of time. A parent will stop at nothing to secure the security and welfare of their child. The pandemic has taught us that safety and protection are needed from both apparent and invisible sources, sometimes much more so. Cell phones and other smart devices are a 20th century invention. Without smartphones, we are unable to imagine our lives. Although they simplify our lives, Smart devices also present a serious health risk. Tens of thousands of smart devices are all around us, and they're all connected to one another via microwaves. Imagine your house and workplace as a network of indistinct rays that flow through the walls and your body. We are always surrounded by electromagnetic emissions, which are invisible microwaves. Some people place their cell phone next to their head as they sleep with the screen on. The cellular makeup of the human body and its ability to absorb microwaves continuously were never intended. Our body's reaction to EMR. Let's see how EMR affects the human body. It is well documented to raise stress levels in people. It may disrupt the brain's electrical activity. In adults, it raises the risk of heart disease. Newborns are more vulnerable. A newborn infant is at a significantly higher risk since their bodily systems are still growing and their skulls are still relatively thin, making it easier for EMR from smartphones and other smart devices to enter their brains. It is commonly known that the rate of development of autism, ADHD, and a few other issues in young children has increased significantly over the past 10 years compared to any of the previous 10. The prolonged and increased exposure of newborns and young children to EMR from smart gadgets can be blamed for a large portion of this. There is an urgent need to exercise caution on smart gadgets. It took 150 years for decision makers to acknowledge the dangers of smoking for one's health and mandate the placement of graphic warnings on the back of every package of tobacco goods. Can we afford to wait so long for any regulation to be passed regarding the use of wireless and smart devices? Studies conducted all around the world provide sufficient evidence of the health risks associated with extended exposure to electromagnetic radiation, particularly for young infants. Many nations have embraced the topic regarding the use of cell phones. Concerning the use of smart devices by young children, numerous nations have issued warnings. Mobile phone sales to children less than 7 are prohibited in Belgium. Mobile phone advertisements are likewise prohibited during children's TV programs. In Australia, parents are advised to restrict their children's access to cell phones. In France, it's against the law to advertise mobile phones to youngsters under the age of 12. Wi-Fi and wireless gadgets are not permitted in nursery classes. In Israel regulations banning the use of Wi-Fi and mobile devices in classrooms have been issued. The usage of wireless networks has been outlawed from preschool through second grade. In India, students are prohibited from bringing mobile phones to class. Advice for parents and expectant mothers. We need to take action right away as caring adults and guardians of our younger generation. Following are a few pointers for expecting mothers and new parents to remember. Mobile phone use should be kept to a minimum for expectant mothers. Do not watch any video content on it for an extended period of time.
Make your voice calls as brief as possible. Use a landline phone if you anticipate needing to speak for a longer period of time. Never use a laptop in contact with your body. Use it by keeping around two feet away from your body. If children are less than four years old, don't let them play with your phone. The use of mobile phones by young children has a significant impact on their language development, reading skills, memory development, and general mental and social development, in addition to the adverse effects of electromagnetic radiation. Utilize technology wisely. Wishing you good health and happiness. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like, share and subscribe. We'll be back with more interesting news. Until then stay safe and take care.